Look to the right. Dirt and sand. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> uh oh, he's allergic to something. It's a motion detector. Mm hmm. I just hear the beeping. Okay. Yeah, you know, I wouldn't dismiss anything of this because we're kind of, you know, in a life or death situation. Okay, nothing else about that. How about investigating the dirt and sand? Actually, the motion detector. Nothing, really? Okay. We're not even moving either. But I heard a beep. It sounds like a motion detector. Listen. Never mind. Okay, I thought there were. Yeah. Well, not in this direction exactly. They ran to the side or something. Investigate the exit. They can liquefy themselves? Or is he joking? I don't know if that's possible or not. That's <laughs> kind of ridiculous. Come on. I, I get it. I get it. You're allergic to something. But what is it? Hmm. Look at the dirt and sand again. Unless by the dirt and sand it means the rubble. I guess I thought it meant something was like left on the ground here. Dirt and sand. Alright, well let's look at the dirt and sand. How we look at the front? Okay. <laughs> what's it what's it trying to tell me? <laughs> I don't follow. Use him for something. Nope. Seems not. Investigate. At what evidence? I guess. Okay. What? He always liked puzzles, so he intentionally gave you a puzzle? <laughs> That's pretty ridiculous. Well. Let's investigate. Or look at the evidence, I mean. At the scrap of paper. Search the house. Does that mean like here or the house? The house. Do we see like a house carved somewhere or something maybe? I mean since we saw these guys run by here, I suggest we need to Oh? Oh, so I, I didn't need to do anything there. I need to retreat. What? As in, like, I should be turning up my volume to hear? I'm listening. Don't hear anything. Oh, well, yeah, I knew that. There's a bomb! Oh, no! Okay. But yeah, it's def... I thought that the, that the beeping sound was the sound of something on Metal Gear, like his... Not his motion detector, but like his listening detector or his listening detector, sound detector, or something like that. Well, what? Oh, okay. Well, let's investigate his blaster. Tch. Yep, no surprise there. Oh, it's bent, huh? Well, I guess we. Do we take it? I don't know if we did or not. Let, can we get out of here? Yeah, I hear it too. Yes, it's trying to get me to do something, but I'm not sure what it wants. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to skip that. I thought it was just more of the same. So he's got a bomb inside. Well, I can't investigate him. Look at little John. He's got a bomb. Yeah. <laughs> Evacuate immediately. There is little time. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. Well, since you told me to, I'll save. 
breaking the fourth wall a bit. Oh, okay, I guess I didn't slot three, but whatever. Yep, let's keep going. So, what can we do about it? Look at the tie bomb. Oh, well, in that case, let's get the hell out of here. So, apparently the... Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. What? Uh, did I? Did I practice enough? Oh. Oh, crud. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. I lost track of what I was, how this worked. This isn't so bad, really. <laughs> I was trying to hold down my draw button while shooting. Oh, shoot. Ah! Ah! Ow! Ah! Damn it. I have to get him in the right order. Otherwise, you're kind of screwed here. Ah! Uh, get my ass handed to me, aren't I? Okay, see, there's clearly a lot of backtracking and like... Oh, god damn it. Yeah, you definitely have to get him in perfectly the right order. Or else there's no nothing else for it. Alright. Fair enough. Yeah, let's continue. <laughs> Alright. It's enjoyable. It really is. Here I don't even have to click to do anything. It just automatically skips ahead with the dialogue for me. I have to keep track of the right order. Come on. Yeah, see, it's, it's odd because I expected that I'd be able to... Um, hold on. Definitely helps that I'm using my thumbstick here. Whoa! Crap. Ah. <laughs> faster, faster! This must have been hell to play with the D-pad. Phew! Perfect. Nice. Okay, but yeah, I, I was not expecting as much investigating multiple times and retreating and then looking again and retreating and looking again. So, just gonna have to get used to it. The bomb's still going, so let's get the hell out of here. We're getting out of here! Sorry, I cannot go with you! What's wrong with you? Hurry it up! I am incapable of locomotion! What? What on earth are you blabbering about? Let's go! It's gonna blow! Please save yourself! I am paralyzed with fear! What? Oh, I can't believe this stupid robot! Come on! <laughs> I like how his portrait kind of grabs Metal Gear's portrait. <laughs> Great, so they programmed him to be freaking useless in a crisis. Jeez, my ears are really ringing. That's because you left the volume turned up. Damn snatchers. There is no need for concern. I have stored all the information about the evidence and the area in my memory. We should return to Junker headquarters. You sound pretty calm for having just friggin' almost gotten blown up because you were being an idiot. <laughs> Yeah, see, Sony! <laughs> We've returned to Junker headquarters. Ooh, that was some first day. Now entering the building. Thanks. Thanks for telling me. We've entered the lobby. Gillian, I heard about Jean. I'm sorry. I wish I could have done more. You performed your duties quite satisfactorily. That's right. It's not your fault, Gillian. Don't worry about it. By the way, the chief is waiting for you. This is the chief's office. I know. Well, Seed, that was a pretty rough first assignment to draw. You made a great effort, though. I've studied the data transmitted back by Metal Gear, so I know all about what happened out there. It's too bad about Gibson. He was a great junker. Seed, I need you to take over for him. You're the only one I've got left who can battle this Snatcher menace. I'm a complete rookie, you realize. <laughs> what, you have no one more experienced at all? That sucks. Okay, there's kind of an awkward pause there while I was just like waiting for me to do something. I didn't even have to do anything, it just kind of decided to move on after a while. Whatever. Let's ask about... The investigative procedure. Sure, why not? Hmm. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, gee, thanks. I did not realize that. It's a good thing I got you here, Chief, to tell me the friggin' obvious. 
All right. Well, detective's room. Well, I guess. See, I'm guessing that the key either goes to a, like a lockbox in his room, or lockbox in his home, or it's just like to his home itself. It's a good thing that the game lets me know that I've got everything necessary or not. That is helpful. That the game won't proceed until I found everything. It would really suck if the game let me move on thinking I'd done everything and then it kind of ended up at a dead end and I wouldn't know why. Okay. Oh, well that's good, I guess. Kind of unfortunate for us, though. Well, let's ask about Katrina, because why not? Uh-huh. How old was she again? Wasn't she pretty young? Let's investigate... The sofa. Chaos so Chaos sofa? Huh. Okay. <laughs> I know that, like, an agent died and stuff, but I just want to ask about that awesome sofa right there. It's so... Retro future. I love it. It's like we fell back into the 40s or something. Wow! Okay. I use him for video phone? I don't know why. Oh, jeez, I don't know. Well, it's good to know that I'll have to be writing this stuff down, though. No, no, no. I don't, I don't want... Do not want. Go back. Well, let me go back. Start? No? Nothing. Call nothing. I don't I don't care. <laughs> the number you have reached is not Okay. Okay, time. thank you. Please check the number and dial again. This is a recording. JT and uh -huh. Neil Kobe. Yeah, cool. Get me out of here. Yeah, don't call. Thank you very much. I assume that since I could call, it would just give me like a name and I just call that, but nope. Clearly not. Okay, well, can I move the hell out of here? Do I have to ask about something else? Maybe I have to use my... Oh, I have to show. That's right. Yeah. Show him my evidence. Mm-hmm. But he also has a house, right? So he probably means... By house, he probably means house. Unless that really is supposed to be a clue for, like, his home away from home. Don't know. What's that junk? Oh, thanks, Chief. That was really helpful. <laughs> we actually have a real piece of useful uh, progress evidence there. And he's like, what's that piece of junk? <laughs> Whatever. Look at anything particular? No. Do I have to investigate the Chief to talk to him about this or what? I don't know. I don't know what you're look expecting me to do. Oh, okay. Here we go. Let's go to the detect detective's room. It's a white place, right? Uh-huh. What? Oh, I should... Oh. <laughs> no, I don't understand you, Chief. Could you please explain? I don't understand the concept you're trying to get at. <laughs> Alright. Do I actually have to go to the shooting range? I'd be happy not to, since I figured it out just fine. It's not that bad. I'm going to Gibson's room. Mm-hmm. Alright. Yep, very basic. So, let's check it out. Near desk. Okay, well, it's probably locked, huh? Let's look at the near desk. Yes, well, investigate the drawers. Oh, oh, I see. Lock desk drawer. There we go. Well, the key? Yeah. But they do! Gasp! <laughs> he actually has to tell me, hey, I think that there was a key. Really? Thank you. Thank you, Metal Gear. I appreciate that assistance. Though. Seriously, though, it is kind of good to have some assistance here. I really do appreciate it. That the game isn't just leaving me high and dry, like mist or something. Uh-huh. Ooh. Cyanide pill? 
Wow. <laughs> you thought that the friggin' key was ancient. No one mentions that the five and a half, five and a quarter inch floppy disk is ancient. No, it's just the key. <laughs> Well, I, I suspect that people will continue be, to use physical keys long into the future, but uh, five and a quarter floppy disks, not so much. Uh, it's disk, I guess. It's actually five and a quarter, okay. Yeah, well, at least they acknowledge that. <laughs> not like, oh man, it's a five and a quarter inch floppy disk. That fits all standard computers these days because this is the future and. Five and a quarter inch floppy disks will never go out of style. No. What kind of medicine is this? I'll perform an analysis. Acid inhibitors, membrane protecting agents, H2 blockers. This is medication for an ulcer. Yeah. Jeez, it looks like Jean's stomach was really in terrible shape. And what was he doing eating buffalo? It seems a little unusual. Perhaps there was some reason that he had to eat buffalo. Hmm. I guess? I really hadn't thought of that being as particularly important, but maybe it is. Let's look at the locker then. Oh. Okay. I wouldn't... I, yeah, I guess it is a locker. I was gonna say, I wouldn't call that a locker. It's more like a... But yeah, I guess it is a locker. Well, let's investigate the locker again. Or the coat, rather. Why would Metal Gear have to check them for you? Okay, great. Part of a puzzle. Let's look at the uh, the code again. Nothing else. Alright, how about... Look at the disc. Okay, they'll have to use that with Metal Gear or something. Meanwhile, look at the chest piece. <clears throat> cool. A wooden one, huh? Alright, well, I'll try looking at these things now. Yeah, well, I assume so. See, it's weird because there's the look and investigate, and it's just so bizarre because they seem redundant. I'm by When I investigate, I assume it means, like, look at it very closely to examine if it's got something important about it. So, what's the point of looking if you can just investigate everything? But yet, look sometimes is necessary because investigation doesn't yield the obvious response, you know, like in this case. Well, duh, of course is evidence, but I have to look at it to, for him to realize that. Why? Huh. Yep. Oh, okay. Well, maybe I want them, huh? You never know. Maybe I'll have a get an ulcer at some point. Alright. Yeah, see, I, again, I have to look for it to be stored as evidence. So weird. Oh, no, no, no. Wrong thing. I don't suppose I can use the floppy disk. No, not the key. Let's get the floppy disk again. Oh, here we go. Okay, well, I guess I have to go to his house. It's my assumption. Um, let's go to the front, I guess. Screw the shooting range. Okay, fine. Go for it. Since those are apparently the only two things. <laughs> you can't stay depressed over these things forever. I mean, the guy that I apparently liked either affectionately or at least as a co-worker got his head friggin' twisted off just a couple hours ago. And <laughs> it's only been like 10 minutes since I heard about it. But, you know, what are you going to do? You can't stay choked about these things forever. You got to move on. <laughs> That's a spirit. Do something. What? Do something. Smell. <laughs> uh, persuade. What? Yeah, I'm gonna console her. Okay, that's not exactly the, con the consolence I was thinking of. I was thinking more of, don't worry, we're gonna take these guys down, or something like that. Not like, hey, don't worry, I'm gonna kick their asses. Darp -a -darp. <laughs> well, then you're very gullible. Sniffer. <laughs> okay, so I can, like, affect, choose what will happen. Interesting. 
persuade her about what? Hey, but... Yeah, I sniffed you. Come on, we totally know each other. <laughs> uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. I really can't don't give a crap about Gillian's stupid love life. <laughs> this is just abusing though. Investigate a plate. Huh? Oh. Okay. Well, what do you mean by that? See, I still don't know what it means exactly by investigate. Let's look at her then. I don't know. <laughs> oh, ask her. That's what I was trying to do, I guess. <laughs> was that option there all along and I just didn't notice it? Maybe. 